Now, let us see how to construct a triangle whose vertex angle is given instead of base angle. Some of its two sides and its base is given. Let us solve examples from exercise 7.3 to understand the steps of construction. 1. Draw triangle ABC in which BC is equal to 5 cm, measure angle A is equal to 50 degrees and AB plus AC is equal to 7.5 cm. Analysis Let us draw a rough figure. Draw base BC of 5 cm. In triangle ABC, AB plus BC is equal to 7.5 cm. Let us produce BA to D such that AC is equal to AD. Then, AB plus AC is equal to AB plus AD is equal to BD which is equal to 7.5 cm. Triangle ADC is an isosceles triangle since AD is equal to AC. Therefore, angle ADC is equal to angle ACD statement 1. Angle BAC is an exterior angle of triangle DAC. From remote interior angle theorem, therefore angle BAC is equal to angle ADC plus angle ACD is equal to angle ADC plus angle ADC from statement 1. Therefore, M angle BAC is equal to 2 angle ADC. But it is given that M angle BAC is equal to 50 degrees. Therefore, 2 angle ADC is equal to 50 degrees. Therefore, ADC is equal to 50 upon 2 is equal to 25 degrees. Now segment BD, BC and angle D of triangle BCD are known as AD is equal to AC, point A lies on the perpendicular bisector of segment CD. In this way, we construct triangle ABC. Let us see the steps of construction. First draw segment BD as the base of length 7.5 cm as it is given that AB plus AC is equal to 7.5 cm. Then take measure of angle D as half of the given measure of angle A. That is, measure angle A is equal to 50 degrees. Therefore, measure angle D is equal to 25 degrees. Take D as center and with 25 degrees measure, draw a ray DX. Now take B as center and draw an arc of length 5 cm, intersecting ray dx at point C. Join B and C. Then draw perpendicular bisector of segment DC. First take D as center, draw two arcs of more than half length CD as radius below and above segment CD. Then with C as center, draw two arcs intersecting the previous arcs with same radius. Join the points of intersection of the arcs to get the perpendicular bisector of segment CD. Make mark the point of intersection of the perpendicular bisector at the segment BD as point A. Next join A and C. We have constructed the required triangle ABC. Now let us take the next example of exercise 7.3 to construct a triangle where the base of the required triangle, the vertex angle and the difference of the remaining sides are given. 2. Draw triangle ABC in which AB is equal to 5.5 cm, measure angle C is equal to 40 degrees and BC minus AC is equal to 2.5 cm. Analysis let us draw the rough figure of triangle ABC. It is given that in triangle ABC, BC minus AC is equal to 2.5 cm. We can locate point D on BC such that DC is equal to AC. Then BC minus AC is equal to BC minus DC is equal to 
2.5 cm. As DC is equal to AC, triangle ADC is an isosceles triangle. Therefore, angle DAC is equal to angle ADC statement 1. Sum of the measure of the angles of a triangle is 180 degrees. Therefore, in triangle ADC, angle DAC plus angle ADC plus angle C is equal to 180 degrees. It is given that measure angle C is equal to 40 degrees and from statement 1. Therefore, 2 angle ADC plus 40 degrees is equal to 180 degrees. Therefore, 2 angle ADC is equal to 140 degrees. Therefore, angle ADC is equal to 70 degrees. Angle BDA and angle ADC form linear pair we get angle BDA is equal to 180 degrees minus ADC. Therefore, angle BDA is equal to 180 degrees minus 70 degrees is equal to 110 degrees. So, in triangle BAD, AB is equal to 5.5 centimeters, BD is equal to 2.5 centimeters, and angle BDA is equal to 110 degrees. Point C lies on the perpendicular bisector of AD. Therefore, in this way, we get triangle ABC, the required triangle. Let us see the steps of construction. First, draw ray BX as the base of the required triangle. Take given measure of BC minus AC on the ray BX. With B as center and 2.5 cm radius, draw an arc on the ray BX. Mark this point as D. Draw ray DY such that measure angle BDY is equal to 110 degrees. Take B as center and with radius 5.5 cm, draw an arc intersecting ray DY at point A. Join points A, B. Now draw perpendicular bisector of segment AD. First with A as center, more than half length of AD, draw two arcs. On the left and right of segment AD, with same radius and D as center, draw two arcs intersecting the previous arcs. Draw a line passing through the point of intersection of the arcs intersecting ray BX at point C. Measure angle C, it is 40 degrees. Join AC. We have constructed the required triangle ABC. Let us now construct a triangle if its base, the sum of the remaining sides and difference between the base angles are given. For this, take the example 3 of exercise 7.3. 3. Draw triangle ABC in which BC is equal to 5 cm, AB plus AC is equal to 8 cm and measure angle C minus measure angle B is equal to 40 degrees. Analysis Let us draw a rough figure of triangle ABC. Draw ray BA. Take point D on it such that AC is equal to AD and BD is equal to 8 centimeters. Since BD is equal to AB plus AD is equal to AB plus AC is equal to 8 centimeters. Angle ACB is greater than angle B. Side opposite to greater angle is greater. Therefore, AB is greater than AC. Let angle BDC is equal to X degrees. Therefore, angle ACD is equal to X degrees since it is given that AD is equal to AC. But angle C minus angle B is equal to 40 degrees. Therefore, Angle B is equal to C minus 40 degrees. That is, angle B is equal to angle BCA minus 40 degrees. In triangle BCD, angle B plus angle BCD plus angle BDC is equal to 180 degrees. Therefore, angle B plus angle BCA 
plus x plus x is equal to 180 degrees. Therefore, angle BCA minus 40 plus angle BCA plus 2x is equal to 180 degrees. Therefore, 2 angle BCA plus 2x is equal to 180 plus 40. Dividing both the sides by 2, we get, therefore, angle BCA plus X is equal to 90 plus 20. Now, angle BCA plus X is equal to angle BCD. Therefore, angle BCD is equal to 110 degrees. Let us see the steps of construction. First, draw segment BC of length 5 centimeters. Take C as center, draw ray CX such that measure angle BCX is equal to 90 plus half of angle C minus angle B. That is, measure angle BCX is equal to 90 plus 40 divided by 2. Thus, measure angle BCX is equal to 90 plus 20. Thus, Measure angle BCX is equal to 110 degrees. Take B as center and radius 8 centimeters, that is AB plus AC, which is given as 8 centimeters. Draw an arc intersecting ray CX in point D. Join BD. Take measure angle BCY as half of angle C minus angle B, which is equal to half of 40, that is 20 degrees. Take C as center and with measure as 20 degrees, draw a ray CY such that measure angle BCY is equal to 20 degrees. Mark the point of intersection of ray CY with segment BD as point E. Take E and C as centers with more than half length EC. Draw intersecting arcs above and below segment EC. Join the points of intersection of these arcs. Let this perpendicular bisector intersect BD at point A. Join A, C. We have constructed the required triangle A, B, C.